It seems straight out of a movie, a jail inmate climbing into the ceiling and making a run for it. It happened in Socorro last month. News 13's Annalisa Pardo talked to Socorro County. She has a look at how that inmate pulled off the escape and how deputies hauled him back in. Stop! Stop! Tense moments in Socorro in May as County Detention Center Officer Isan De La Roca catches up with Grant Stewart. You better f stop! Stop! I got him, dude. After Stewart escaped from the County Detention Center. It blew my mind to find out how he ended up doing this. County Jail Administrator Eddie Garcia says Stewart was a felon and sex offender from Colorado, picked up in New Mexico. He says Stewart was detoxing in a booking cell when he got up onto the sink and started working on screws in the ceiling. He uh, got our, our blanket, he got the string, the blanket, and he started working. He wrapped it around the screw and he just kept working on it, kept dwindling it over and over and and he ended up getting it. It's, it's, he ended up saying it took him about four to six hours to finally get one done and then he just started working on it and then he kind of bent that 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 you know little metal piece down and that's how we got through county manager michael hawks says he crawled through the ceiling the space that he opened up the vent maybe 14 inches wide and maybe 20 inches this way so it's amazing how he got through there before falling into garcia's office and taking off but not before ransacking the office through and ditching his uniform using a plastic bag to cover himself. Armed with only mace, detention officer De La Roca followed Stewart. I'm just amazed at uh, the officer's uh, uh, fortitude to actually go after him. And right away, uh, the classification is they're more than likely going to be dangerous because they're not going to go easy. He maced him, causing Stewart to run again before De La Roca caught up again. Stop! Eventually, local law enforcement showed up on scene and arrested Stewart, who refused medical treatment when initially booked, but claimed. That's all I wanted was to go to the hospital. I asked for hours and hours to go to the hospital. They wouldn't take me. Annalie Sapardo, Care QE, News 13. For that escape, Stewart was charged with escaping from jail and burglary.